Okay, guys. Hi. Welcome back. Um, it's winter. So now there's going to be an awful lot of background noise because my heater, we ended up having to turn it on. Um, we were hoping to be able to just do the stove. It wasn't enough. It got down to like negative something the other day and I was like, the pipes are going to freeze. So let's, let's not, let's not do that. Uh -huh. So we turned the heater on so that it can heat up the upstairs. So it's on now. I love you all and I'm very sorry. Uh, today I am going to do a product review and actually this is going to have happened a whole lot sooner. Just one second, my baby. Thank you for using your manners. I'm going to actually have recorded this a long time ago and I'm going to sit on it until I am allowed to release it because there is a new product that will now be available to you guys. And I am super excited about it because it's a company that I absolutely love. Uh, I love what they stand for. I love what they do. So I will show you that in just a minute. With every star, we are born again. Open your heart. Okay, so we're back. Um, Bella, can you do me a favor and go get the little box from over there? Go get the little one. Right there? Yep, that one right over there. You go get that. We're going to do that one. This is kind of strong. I'm gonna, oh. I'm gonna tip you guys down a little bit. Okay, good. You can see. Woo! But you're moving. Okay, camera has been readjusted. Okay. You want me to open it? Go ahead. You can open it. Okay. So, this is the company. Oh, cheese and sprinkles. <laughs> but I'm gonna do a review for you with <clears throat> keto chow. Now. Apple pie. I'm going to turn this one into an apple pie Dutch baby, I think. I think that's what this and one's going to be. Are you going to turn this one into where you want to cut? There's so many things. There's so many things that we're going to do with this. Smells like. Now, you guys know I'm not super huge on products, but I thoroughly believe that there is a time and there is a place for every single one of these items that I'm showing you today. You gotta be strong, girl. You gotta be strong. Haha, she did it. This is the brand new product that I have been using that you guys will now be able to purchase. Keto Chow now has dried egg white powder because, you know, we're doing all of these amazing things with the egg bread. Uh, so today I'm going to make my Hawaiian sweet rolls with the Keto Chow's brand new egg white powder. Package isn't even opened yet, never done it yet, so you guys are gonna get to see exactly how that performs. <clears throat> so they sent me apple pie, key lime, Irish cream, orange mango, and guava grapefruit. And then wow, grapefruit. they sent me an essential starter kit. So why don't you open that? Can you open the top? Can you rip the part, the top apart? Good job. Now you can take stuff out of it. Oh, woo! Good catch. <laughs> and then we have their blender bottle. I have two of these already, and I'm actually super happy to have another one because I love these blender bottles. Um, in the essentials kit, that is the salted caramel, lemon meringue, chocolate. Vanilla, uh, Snickerdoodle, and then the Caramel Macchiato. I actually got uh, another Caramel Macchiato, and I have that over in the freezer. Uh, I made mine. I'll actually put up the video so that you all can see how I made it, and I posted it on Instagram. Can you open that? Can you get it open? Do you need some scissors? I made up the caramel macchiato. You can get the scissors, sweetie, if you can't. Oh, I guess it's folded over. She's fine. Um, you, I made up the caramel macchiato. I did a quarter cup of butter, one whole raw egg. Some people are afraid of that. I'm not. I'm absolutely not afraid of doing a raw egg, especially if I'm gonna cool it down in my freezer. Good job. 
So I put this in the freezer. Um, I did one and a half cups of water. I think it was a little bit too much, like one and a quarter, maybe even one if you like more flavor and concentrate. Then um, the caramel macchiato powder, blended it really, really good. And then I stick it in the freezer because I'm not prepared enough ahead of time generally to have it in the fridge overnight ready for me the next morning i don't usually drink these like i i really don't i try good job i try to stick to whole foods but i'm going through a serious meat aversion right now but yesterday can you throw it away yesterday i was eating my eggs in the morning i made four eggs about halfway through i started just to not even be able you want to color on that to not even be able to swallow. So I put some cheese on it. I was like, okay, the cheese is gonna help me. Why don't you go get your color pencils and stuff and you can color on it. So I added some cheese to my eggs. And by the time I got to the end of my eggs again, I still could barely swallow. I just, I, I don't know what's up. I'm having the hardest time eating right now, any kind of meat or, or really protein. So I'm gonna bring these guys back in. These are what I have on hand. Right now, money is tight. Uh, for us, uh, such a big family, money is, is tight a lot. So I am going to absolutely make use of all of the stuff that they sent me. And I think that the timing is perfect and it's gonna kind of help me get over a little bit of a hump. So <clears throat> this, I, I don't leave it in there too terribly long, um, but I like it when it's just starting to get a little bit chunky. Uh, mm-hmm. Because I need something. The caramel macchiato itself, um, with a half a stick of butter, which is what I put in there, has 20, 26.69 grams of protein. Well, I added my egg in there too. So I'll uh, put up the macros of what that looks like right over Bella's face. Um, <clears throat> so I increased the protein by adding that egg. Honestly, next time I might do two eggs, uh, the two raw eggs in there. I have been doing raw eggs for years and I've never had a problem with it. So if you're not comfortable with it, that's perfectly fine. But this is what I, I don't mind doing it. And yes, I even use the commercial eggs um, from Walmart because my chickens are on strike right now. So this is a raw, very cheap commercial egg from Walmart. Also been doing that for years and have not yet gotten sick. As soon as I do, I will let y'all know if there's a problem, but after 35 years of eating raw commercial eggs from eating, you know, things like cookie dough and batter, I'm still good so far. Anyways, I love Keto Chow, what they stand for. They have mostly clean ingredients. <clears throat> if you have a problem with things like xanthan gum, then this isn't gonna be for you. They do use sucralose in it, to sweeten. It is at the very end, uh, towards, the, towards the very end, like the third one from the end. And I have no problem with that. Now you get to make your own choice. I love their products, especially for women who are pregnant and maybe have the same meat aversion and they want more fat and protein, but they've got those really bad cravings because you're pregnant. You want ice cream? This is absolutely the best way to do that. Or if you have elderly parents or any family members who would really benefit from getting more protein and fat in their diet, these keto chow shakes are amazing. Another thing that we love is keto chow's daily mineral drops. <clears throat> Excuse me. Richard uses these every day when he makes his drink. It's kind of his little replacement for soda or kombucha or whatever. Um, he will put this in there and it's got, you can see, uh, kind of see, it's got a little bit of a blue tint to it because it's got all of your daily minerals in it. So this is absolutely wonderful. We've also used their electrolyte drop and we, uh, we actually switched over to the daily minerals just because it has a few more things. I've tried their magnesium drops. I've heard that they work wonders I just couldn't get past the taste, but that's because I'm a wuss. So anyways, I'm going to go drink this and then we are going to make some Hawaiian sweet rolls with the new powder. So we'll get right to that. 
Begin by opening up your brand new package of Keto Chow egg whites. Make a slight mess on the counter. One half cup egg white powder. One third cup allulose. Two tablespoons nutritional yeast. One quarter teaspoon salt and one quarter teaspoon regular yeast. Two teaspoons cream of tartar and one teaspoon xanthan gum. Mix all those together, then throw in one cup of liquid egg whites. Beat on high until stiff peaks form. I have to say, this did take longer with this egg white powder. I was actually beginning to worry that it wouldn't work, but it did finally take. So this one does take a little bit longer to blend. Once they are stiff peaks, turn the speed down to medium and slowly add five yolks. I wait about five to maybe 10 seconds in between each yolk so that they can incorporate, but not deflate the whites. You have to go slowly, but not too slow. Use a quarter cup scoop to scoop the fluff onto a parchment lined pan. Bake in the oven at 325 degrees for 15 minutes. When they're done baking, you can let them cool in the oven for another 15 or pull them out. I chose to let them cool for another 15 minutes. Okay, so these have been cooling for a little while. There they are. They look just like the other ones um, that I made before. Ooh, they didn't cave in on the bottom. You know how sometimes you make them and they cave in on the bottom? Mine, mine usually cave in on the bottom. They didn't cave in on the bottom at all. Still tear apart really well. They're even more light and airy than the other ones are. I attempt to put some butter on them, but the butter's really hard because my house is cold because there's a lot of snow outside. And these aren't warm anymore because I had to go get on a, on a live, so. There we go, okay. Mm. Yeah. Hmm. They're even more light and airy than the other ones were. Uh, they have excellent flavor. Very good success. Whenever I run out of uh, egg white powder, I think I will definitely be ordering this. Mm. Yep. So that is my review of Keto Chow's new egg white powder. I think that they did an excellent job. They actually developed this with Maria Emmerich. So of course it's gonna work really well for all of the protein sparing breads. Uh, two thumbs up for sure. Love Keto Chow, love their products. Um, love what they do for the community and the, the type of people that they are. So thank you so much for checking in with us today. I hope that you enjoy this product review that happened a long time ago and is now released. And uh, go get yourself some Keto Chow Egg Whites because that I'm very impressed. They are very, very good Hawaiian sweet rolls. I'm gonna go eat like four more of these. Thank you so much, guys. Please do all of the things and we'll see you on the way. Bye. Oh, it recorded. Oh, it's on the button again. I keep doing that. Look at that face. Look at that adorable face. Are you going to go get the box? Am I going to go get the box? In a minute. I'll go get the box. Just a minute. Okay. Oh, it's moving. No, 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 no. Stay. Uh, in just a second, I will let you tell them that I'm going to open the box. You want that one and I'll use this one? 
this one so I'm a little bit small. Oh, would you like this one instead? What is it? Uh, <laughs> lemon lime. Yeah. Oh, no, it's good. Yeah, it's all good. My lips taste like lemon. <gasps> My lips taste like lemon, too. How many does that make? I'm um, not enough. Not enough? <laughs> yeah. It's on. You know what I'm getting for Christmas? You know what I'm getting for Christmas for you? A pair of keys to a school bus. I can drive it over you? Mm-hmm. Turn me under the bus again. Beep. Beep. <laughs> Do you want a sweet roll? Is it the ones I like? It's the ones that you like. <laughs> Which one do you want? I don't know, you tell me. Mm. Do you love it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Woo! Daddy's crushing cans. Skit! Okay, I'm gonna take my thumbnail now. <laughs>